Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Moon Project. We here at the Moon Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to information, education, guidance, advice, and uh, I want to continue with a few brief little snippets about uh, Rabbi Schneur Zalman of Liadi, the Alta Rebbe, the founder of the Chabad Hasidic movement. Um, someone once asked uh, the Alta Rebbe, uh, also known as the Balatanya, after his great work, the Tanya. Someone wants to ask uh, Shner Zalman of Liadi, when the Messiah comes, when Moshiach comes, will he will he will he be um, one of the Hasidim, or will be one of the Misnagdim? Will he be one of the Misnagdim? Misnagdim were the opponents of the Hasidic movement in the 1700s. Centered usually in uh, in Lithuania, the Litvisher, the Litvak uh, segment of Ashkenazi uh, Jewry in Europe, is he going to be a, a Chosid like us, or is he going to be a Miznagdin like them? The question was like half in jest. Delta Rebbe Shnerzaman of Liadi thought about it for a second, and he said, "I think he will be a Miznagdin." I think he'll be one of the Misnagdim. And the Hasidim said, okay, why? He says, because if the Moshiach was a Chosid, the Misnagdim would never recognize him as Moshiach because of their opposition to us. However, if Moshiach came and he was one of the Misnagdim, if he was one of them, the Hasidim would truly see that he was in fact uh, Moshiach and they would accept him. Um, Rabbi Schnurzom of Liadi, the founder of the what is now the Chabad Lubavitch worldwide movement, um, shortly before his death, uh, he asked his grandson, I believe this would have been Rabbi Mendel of Lubavitch, he asked his, ran, his grandson, Do you see anything? The boy looked at his grandfather in astonishment. He, he didn't know what to say. The Alter Rebbe smiled and said, all I can see is the divine nothingness which gives life to the world. Um, Shner Zalman of Liadi, during his life, wrote Tanya. Uh, many view this great work as being um, the Kabbalah, the mystical parts of Judaism. Kabbalah made practical how to live your life as a chosid. People who read it, who study it, get a great deal of insight uh, out of mysticism and the Kabbalah and how to live your life um, as a Jew. Um, Yiddishkeit uh, Judaism owns, owes a great debt to Rabbi Shneur Zalman of Liadi, the Balatanya, the Alta Rebbe. We're going to be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back. Please watch. Please learn. I hope you're finding them uh, of some inspiration, of some use. And until next time, on behalf of the Amuna Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you too much.